Welcome to the new age of F&I. Today's automotive buyer requires more transparency and resists sales pressure more than ever before. While some managers try to ignore the inevitable, it's time for you to make a change in how you do business in the finance office. Gone are the days of asking customers questions only to use their words against them. Gone are the days of overcoming objections so you can feel that you won the argument and probably lose the sale. Gone are the days where we place dented rims in the corner of our office and adorn our desk with expensive service bills and broken down car parts. The old school techniques listed above are becoming less and less effective because buyers have become very skeptical of the process. This sales skepticism has created roadblocks in the F&I office. Some of you probably already noticed it. Have you ever thought, this just seems harder than it used to be. <laughs> it's not just you. As I said before, some managers have tried to ignore this inevitable shift, and that's actually a good thing for you. While they hold on to the way things used to work, you can choose to evolve and subsequently advance within the ranks of your dealership and the F&I community. The new age of F&I is simple. Number one, you are a professional finance manager, not a glorified salesperson who sits in the finance office. Number two, your office is a professional finance office and as such is bland and contains no brochures, sales gimmicks, or anything else that will cause sales skepticism in the customer's mind. Number three, you inform the customer of their options. You don't sell them. You don't pressure them. You don't use their words against them and you don't engage in a debate with them. The respect you show to the customer is clear and they can feel it. The entire framework of FinanceManagerTraining.com is predicated on these principles. Are you ready for the new age of F&I? Good. Now let's get to work.